Hello and welcome back. So we have to save New Jericho from getting annihilated by <clears throat> mutant crabs. So let's not hesitate. Although my guys are a little tired, so I'm I'm a hes I'm definitely a little hesitant to <laughs> to get into this fight. Wait, can I just wait? Can I just go back to the base and rest? Oh no. Scan complete. <clears throat> so they're gonna like me more. Seems like... Oh. Oh yeah, let's do it. Uh... Equipment... I guess we can put in a... Oh, grenade. Right, let's do that. <clears throat> So, apparently this is gonna be a very easy fight. At least according to the... Information I was given before the... Well, apparently the defender's strength is 12 and the attacker's strength is 1. So, they're getting repelled even without my help. I'm basically just showing up to like, Hey, what's up? I was here too. So, where's the reward? And, uh, yeah. Let's do that. <clears throat> yeah, Soldier Dash is actually quite nice, if you want to close in. And I do want to pick up Heavy uh, Gun for the guy who actually can do Heavy Weapons. And Soldier Dash. That's quite cool. Although it doesn't seem like Soldier Dash is an ability that we can pick up with with uh, anyone. It is <clears throat> seems like the second row of abilities that we can pick up are, are separate from the class skills. So, just something to keep in mind. <clears throat> I can make a vehicle as well. Eventually, we'll, we'll do that. Maybe. So, apparently, key structures protected 100%. Kill all enemies. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah. So... That is apparently a key structure. Is this a key structure? That's the key structure. Okay, then. So we can jump in this window. I don't like this window. Like, terrible design. Who the hell thought this was a... Like, the, the whole place seems like a fortress, but apparently has like these big ass windows. Make no sense. Who the fuck designed this? <laughs> the aliens? That's the only way it makes sense. <clears throat> yeah. Huh. I'm a little hesitant to rush in. Oh, shit. Key structures protected. That's not the only one. Oh, that, uh, there's actually three. There are actually three. Uh, buildings that need to be protected. Right there. You're seeing nobody? Okay. What's our move? I guess I'm just gonna <clears throat> run there. Mm. Moving now. Just, just play it safe. Target in sight. Oh shit, we got someone? But who? Oh yeah, Cameron is the spotter. But who did we spot? Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Uh, she definitely can spot people. 45? Yeah, that's that's 45 uh, squares, I guess. It's like 20. Wait, it's not? It's 5, 10, 20, 30. I don't know, I'll just say. Well, it doesn't... Well, 45 is the max. Up to 45 squares is we can spot people, but that's pretty far Moving. away. Loud and clear. That guy. <clears throat> it does seem like we can't shoot at him. Uh, I can just get closer. Making haste. Maybe look that way. 
Okay, well, hopefully they don't fuck it up. This is a time-sensitive mission, apparently. Wait, what? They're already fucking the place up? Do we have any friendly soldiers that's gonna help us? Okay, Cameron, where are you? If someone goes first, it should be you. No enemy spotted. Your position. Oh shit, we, we spotted someone. <clears throat> They're making a beeline. Okay. From here we can't see anybody, but from Moving here... Down. We actually see one person. And because of we have a sniper... This is a tough shot, but with the sniper it's actually a viable shot. It has like a 80% or 85% chance of hitting. And if he just keeps dicking around, he's gonna die to the bleed. Okay. Channel open. Acquiring target. We can finish off him with a salvo. Not guaranteed, but it is possible. Okay, and this is where the game out. very much comes into play. We just come over here, make the shot. And then hide. So, we can just order our actions how the hell we want. Which is awesome. Uh, but where do we go? <clears throat> uh, this guy needs to... Go. Oh crap, we spotted somebody. That is a guy who can shoot. They don't care. They just go for the objective. It's actually quite tanky. Now we know about its uh, status. Seemed like it was just a pistol shot. At least three guys over there. We don't know of any more. We can't fly in close to them. That doesn't work. Okay, we can keep closing in and shooting. What about the sniper? The sniper cannot shoot anybody. Actually, from over there, we have a an angle. I'm not Let's sure how good of, is that angle, but ready to fire. Wow, uh, we're gonna just do Overwatch. Although I believe Overwatch is only two action points, that allows us to keep moving forward. Heading out. I see them. Oh, we see somebody. We can't even make a shot. Oh yeah, we can make a shot. But we can't overwatch. So if they c try to pass us... I'm ready. Uh, they're gonna be in trouble, perhaps? I think we're just gonna keep getting close. Moving to position. Can we make a shot? It's not a great shot, but it is... something. Oh! We destroyed the launcher arm? The fuck is the launcher arm? We don't know, it's destroyed now. <laughs> Does he have it too? Yeah, it's an Artron. Well... Machine gun, launcher arm, deals 30 blast damage with 3 armor shreds at a 
closest distance, so it's like an AoE weapon. Okay, AoE 50 blast damage weapon that takes uh, two action points, so you can actually use it twice. 100 damage. Machine gun is two a ammo, so yeah, I mean, this is a uh, 70 damage. Pretty low effective range weapon. And spitter head, which is effective range of five. It poisons people for 60 and deals 10 damage. Holy shit. So, this guy's low ranged, but he can, well, maybe a little low damage except the poison. We're not using the dash just yet because they can dash in fast, but the others can't really keep up. Although it might be sensible to use it. <clears throat> okay. Running. I'm just getting close. That's for that's fine for now. Let's just enter. Oh shit. That's what I was afraid of. If he's uh busy with the objective, that's fine by me. Sniper. Oh, fuck. Connect the shot. He moved a lot. Oh shit. Disabled my arm. So we can't shoot anymore. I should have played it safer. It's hard to get it right when it comes to, well, when it comes to blind, a time mission. <clears throat> so we cannot use the shotgun anymore. I mean, uh, the assault rifle anymore. The Triton came in. Uh, he has a pretty okay pistol. And a blood-sucking arm. Chameleon. I don't really want to get close to them. What are we doing? Well, we can do grenades. Let's switch to the grenade. If you can somehow land on the guys in the back, that would be the best. We can do a dash. Oh, we can do. We can punch him in the face. How good is that? Hit an enemy with a held item. Can we? <laughs> what? I'm holding a grenade. Um. <laughs> Why do I have a feeling this is a bad idea? <laughs> I mean, it might be totally safe to punch people with. I mean, <laughs> what the fuck do I do? <laughs> How good is punching people? I, I know that he's okay at that. He has higher damage. Can we just fly in? No, we can't. And if I fly... If I decided to fly... We're gonna be in trouble. So, we can just... Uh, shoot this guy. I think he's just gonna die, right? Well, actually, that was a bad idea. We almost hit our own guy. If if we had excess damage, then I suppose that would have hurt. It didn't do much. Wait, what? What happened to you? We have some kind of effect on him. Uh, bleeding tan. Oh, we already dashed. No, no, that's just an ability we can do. We are not already dashing. We lost some action points. We can barely move. There. Channel open. Okay. So sniper. Receiving loud and clear. Sniper can make a shot Firing apparently. Target. But it is an abysmal shot. I don't think it's gonna get much better. If he can somehow hit the guy who's in the window, that would be the best. But it seems like we can't get an angle on him. 
It'll be somewhere around here. Yeah. We need to close in a lot more. And we also have a guy here. God damn it. Okay, let's just close in with the sniper. What's our plan? Maybe the... I don't know if I want to dash in. Okay, let's dash in. Can I use the grenade? Let's try this. No, we don't have the range for this. I can't shoot at them. I can't even hit the guy who's standing in the window. I shouldn't get too close. That's for sure. That's not great. I think we're just gonna cover them. Game. Oh, we can't cover? Oh yeah, we can't cover. I was like, why is it not working? It's not working because... We lost our hands. So we can't shoot. I can throw grenades. I can come over here. Wait, no? No, 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 no. Actually, I'm dumb. That's fine. <clears throat> I was, I was, I was not on my, uh, gun. Uh, one for sure. We come over here. Wait, is that gonna be the... The edge? Heading out. Okay, let's come over here. Maybe try to kill the guy in the window. This seems kind of doable. And we just need to hide. I'm not exactly sure where. We can just hide far away. <clears throat> Yeah. That's fine. Alright, he's dead. Okay. Saving loud and clear. He is in a bad spot. We can use a med kit on him. Do you have one though? He... Infrared does have one. Okay, let's do it. Fred, fucking do it. What are we doing? He's really struggling with action points. Does he have one action point to turn because of the... Because of the bleed? He has 9 wheel power. I don't know. I, I'm not sure why he has so few action points. So we can make a shot. But maybe we can get closer and make a shot. Not by much. But this is not a terrible shot. Not a terrible shot. Although we need to give him a little extra. What's our plan? Yeah, I mean, no. The sniper is not exactly the best rusher. We can come in a little closer. Making haste. Switch to the pistol and make a Target. shot. Yeah, this should be good enough. Took one down. And the last guy is in here. Repositioning. So now Priority we're just gonna uh, get in position. <clears throat> yeah, he's uh, he's very much inside. I'm not sure if we should start moving this turn. 
Probably not. I wouldn't mind at least two people uh, doing the assault. We have some supplies, but we can get that after the mission. Where the hell is he going? He's going to the showers. And I feel bad. Channel it's kind of like a chapel. We can't go in. When he finished with his business, we're gonna get him. Okay. Let's see now. He does have the potential to one-shot him. We also need to be careful though. So I think his position is, is just fine actually. We can get a little closer, although he's far more likely to get hit. Hiding behind the the, the door is Let's better. Go. This is actually safer, but uh, less useful. Uh, let's just go on the heal on yourself. I like taking kids. <laughs> I don't like uh, losing people, but I do like taking kids. Makes it makes the stakes real. Positioning, prioritizing speed. Yeah, I don't know. I don't want to get too close. Clear. The guy who doesn't have an arm uh, can still Let's throw go. grenades, so I guess that that's something. We can't uh, fix the hand injury, by the way, so... He just cannot use the rifle for the rest of the game, because he got shot once. He's doing jack shit, he's just hiding in the shower. Oh man. I can maybe blow his wall. Uh, we can get closer. Making haste. I guess we're just gonna get close and uh, just brush him down. Moving fast. Three people. Just goes in. Hey, what's up? It would be best if the heavy did it. What's our move? So can you just get down? You can. Not the path I would have taken, but seems like he's not a big fan of stairs. Loud and clear. Yeah, I don't know. Wait, did we heal our hand? No, this is not the one with the injured hand. Yeah, hand is injured permanently. I was like, maybe I'm wrong, What's our but plan? no, I'm totally right. I don't want to get too close, though. Okay, and turn. What is this? Why are you hiding in the f fucking uh, bathroom? I mean, if I get close, he's probably going to be like, Oh, Steven, loud. I was waiting for you. <laughs> Wait, what? That gives you cover? On all sides. What? Okay. Our choice. <clears throat> uh Oh, we opened the door. I shot at him. You suck! All enemies will have Two less action points, and this cost us free uh, willpower to do. Can 
Can I just get in closer? <laughs> this is so awkward. We don't have enough to kill him. Maybe the sniper. Oh man. This is not good. <laughs> we can get closer. I mean, if he rushes in, <clears throat> that's gonna be uh, a hit. Uh, that's it for now. He's not loving the war cry. Okay, time to take him out. Enough dicking around. Can we get an angle on him? Yeah, we can. Moving to position. Surprise! Let's see what we get. Uh, I'll shoot him in the head. Works! <laughs> Even the fence! Oh. Okay, fair enough. I mean, this was a easy mission. <clears throat> Even though we got hit once, lost our hand. When a faction becomes supportive, it will give you the location of all of its havens. Really? That seems pretty good. Come on. Are we gonna get... Okay, uh, that goes up. I'm not sure which is which, but... I guess we improved our relation with the faction. We found a Gauss machine gun magazine. Some, just some magazines, but we don't have the guns for that. Well then, we can go back to base and heal. Okay. Uh, I guess we're just gonna pass time at the base for now. I'm getting the grenades. I just maybe we should just just use less grenades just so we can actually make gear for my soldier. We're still healing and resting, and we're done. This new Jericho neural tech we've been hearing about. It sounds like a pretty cool technology, really, but has anyone thought about how easily it could be abused by, uh, I don't know, an autocratic leader with delusions of grandeur? That's a worrying possibility. New Jericho is a society of laws and principles. There will be no abuse. I don't know. No comment. <laughs> Yeah, it's concerning. I'll give you that. It is, isn't it? Sometimes I miss the days when such questions were just science fiction. But I guess sooner or later the future arrives and then you have to deal with it. Wait, what? So, Synedrion likes me more. Oh man. New Jericho likes me less. Wait, this was a private message. God damn it. I thought, thought we had something special here. And you just go go out there and like tell everyone that I, I have concerns. Oh man, okay. The more the disciples of Anu invest into this mutation tech, the further away they will move from what New Jericho considers humanity. This is not a threat, but a statement. Okay. There is still time to look to reason, not superstition, for solutions. To seek answers in human will, instead of submission to the alien. But that time is running out. I decided you all suck. I'm enslaving everybody. I don't think that works. <laughs> Wait, what? <clears throat> we don't know what that is. Other than the fact that it's <clears throat> inside the mist. So, our guys are healed up. We're still manufacturing. We have a lot of materials. 
Can we manufacture vehicles? We're making the Odin armor. Making a, a PX Scarab uh, costs us over four days of work. And we also have to make a Hell Cannon. Actually, at this point, maybe not a Hell Cannon. Because the personnel. Oh my god, I'm. I'm struggling with bullets. Uh, personnel. I just don't take any more, that's, that's fine. We, we take enough bullets, okay? Uh, so what do I want? So one of them can train heavy weapons. It's Fred. It costs 25. But this is only relevant if he level up again. Which is actually quite close. So, yeah. Let's go with Hell Cannon. And I would like... Some, some, of, some of these items are manufactured instantly. Others... Not so much. Like, map kit is pretty useful. I would like to make a scarab, but uh, yeah, let's try to make that a thing, and uh, eventually we'll get it, I guess. I would like to also speed up the research. So we can get a... <clears throat> Actually, power consumption is a bit concerning here. Wait, which one is the... Yeah, research lab costs us free power. I don't know. <laughs> if I get it... Uh, we don't have enough power for it. So basically we have two options. Either I, I don't make a power a plant or make a power plant and it's gonna be fairly useless. Let's not let's just not make anything right now. And they're building a factory. I think this shows that we have one soldier from them. And uh, I guess we're gonna head out. What is this? Oh, that's a mission. <clears throat> I just explore. Oh. Yeah, sure. There are a lot of Synedrion bases here, so maybe we should just ally with the Synedrion, regardless of uh, what could make the most sense. Export site. Our operatives have discovered the cryogenics laboratory Symes mentioned in his notes. It appears to have been a government facility, possibly a black site of some kind. As far as we can tell, Symes came here to examine samples collected in the 1960s. Unfortunately, the facility has been compromised and now functions as a base for a group of raiders. No, it doesn't. I'll show you. <laughs> that is not the case. Raiders. Just join my... Yes! In the tutorial, I could... I actually found that guy. And apparently you can find guys on missions, so maybe we can find the raider. I mean, when it comes to this, wouldn't you join up with the... Uh, let's kick the butt of the alien force? Even if you're a little cowardly, co cowardly uh, if the alternative was death. Because let's just say I was the thief at that fa uh, facility that attacked them and whatever. And these badasses showed up and they just like, you know, we're gonna kill you now. And I would be like, you know, oh no, I'm with you guys now. And like, and they're gonna be like, oh yeah, you know, uh, that makes sense. Uh, sure, welcome aboard. Because why not, you know? It's humanity versus the fucking beasts.
So we have this quick aim ability that actually costs us free willpower to use. In order to actually take advantage of this and have a, like a double, uh, double uh, shot turn, we have to get uh, three more willpower, else it's just completely useless. Because we can shoot for two. Well, not completely useless, but we won't be able to uh, double fire the sniper rifle. We can do a, I don't know, a grenade or two pistol shots uh, in addition to it, but that's not the goal. Obtain the research data. And in this scenario, unlike in every other cases so far, I'm just gonna play it super safe. We're gonna play it super slow. Wait, which one is the spotter? It's not Fred. Channel open. It's Cameron, uh, Dragon Beards. Okay, that's a decent I'm ready. opener. Running. Yeah. What's our plan? Okay. I've got this covered. Actually, we can move uh, one more. Moving to position. And we can still overwatch. Oh, look at that. Bleeding torso. Uh oh. It's a heavy. Action. Yeah. They're quite far away. So let's see what they got. Seem to be having a carrying a pretty uh, heavy weapon. Do they have... Uh, they have war cry? They have heavy training. So that means they can fly in. And they're carrying a very tough gun. Which deals 40 damage 10 times. 400 damage at a very short range. And yeah. They got... Three guys that do that, but they also have one guy in the, in the back, which is just an assault. Effective range of 20. Here. Uh, we're not gonna close in on them. Channel open. Uh, range is our friend here. Targeting. That's not great. Uh, this is a decent shot. I don't know if he can take advantage of the pistol. I mean, might be. Although, he's, he's fairly tanky. Let's do something like that. Okay. A grenade seems pretty uh, juicy. Yeah. And uh, Fred has a has a long range grenade throwing ability. So doing it. Actually, that works. Okay. And we can also shoot at the other heavy. No, no, we can't. I think we might need to just cover. Uh, let's see who we see. We don't see the heavy in the uh, on the left side. And this guy's uh is kind of fine. But I wouldn't mind taking some cover here. I'm ready. Yeah, you you just go for uh, an overwatch here. I'll keep my eyes open. Uh, this guy's gonna die for sure. What's our move? Heavy. 
good bloody question. What should we do? The assault. We can try to hide from the assault a little bit. Yeah, I don't really want to close in. That's fine. Right there. Let's hide from the assault's line of fire. But it's also possible that the heavy try to fly in, maybe? I don't know. I've never fought anything like this. We can take shots at the guy in the back, but it would be probably preferable if he took a good cover. And actually in this game, it's not about what the cover uh, actually gives you, but like how it looks like. The best looking cover here is this. this. We spotted a new enemy, oh, no, no, that, an enemy we, we definitely knew about before. Oh no, this is the one. Who is he? I don't have a... Let's check him out. So he is... A berserker? Okay. He can stomp. Daisy immune. He has a grenade, but other than that he has a, a melee weapon. A lot going on here, but he can just stay back for now. Berserker is quite tanky. Yeah, let's just take the shot. We damaged his gun, I believe. But let's just wait. Heavy stanky. I'm gonna do this. Oh snap. We can't move around now. Okay then. Channel open. I mean, we can move around a little bit, I think. Can I just make a shot at the, the heavy that's close by? We can go over here. It seemingly gives us new cover, but it, it does. Ready to engage. I don't know. I'm ready. Well, hiding behind the pillars definitely helps us. Preparing to fire. Yeah, that's a decent shot. Let's see what we can hit with the sniper. Actually, the sniper rifle. Ready to fire. So we can hit the same guy. We can hit the ranger in the back. Uh, that's probably what we should do with the sniper. I don't know what to do with the heavy. I can shout that they have less action points, but for that we would need to be damn close. If I get a little closer, Moving out. we can make a shot at the nearby guy, and it's not a terrible shot. If I hit like this, it's almost guaranteed that, that we hit some of them, one of them. Oh, <laughs> I destroyed his gun. So he's completely useless now, except for the fact that he can punch. We can just go, go behind the pillar, I guess. So this guy is a uh, non-threat. But we don't have too many other people to shoot at. No! Uh, we can just take that shot. Yeah! Channel open. Okay, just just chill. We're pinned down because one of them will be watching. 
Yeah, wow. I'm not a huge fan of these uh, shots. Although his overwatch is like from super far away, it's almost guaranteed to miss, but if it doesn't, it it's probably gonna be an insta-kill. Well, no. No, because he has a different gun than me, but it's gonna hurt. Let's try a grenade. It's too far away. I think we're just gonna go for a shot, then reload. No, a shot and uh shot on who? Oh, we can hit this guy. But he's super tanky. There's no way. Okay. Uh assault rifle is completely useless against him. What the hell am I supposed to do? I think I'm gonna use a, a grenade still. No, we can't. I don't know what to do. Okay, let's Let's act with someone else first. Sniper is usually quite easy. As long as we uh, we can see someone, we can shoot at him. Yeah, that's that's fine. Okay. Yeah, make the shot. Oh, is he going to die from bleeds? He's damn close. He's not going to die from bleed next turn, but he's gonna die the turn after. We can just take a, a pistol shot as well. Or we want to move around. Um, argument can be made for both. Let's We're just move around. Now. I don't know what to do with her. Dragon beards. Uh, we definitely want to stay in cover, not trigger the overwatch shot if we were so careful already. Ready to fire. To avoid that. He's going to die eventually. This guy doesn't have a weapon. Oh man. I can't see anybody else. We can do a dash. But I probably shouldn't. We can't really damage that guy. The thing is, the, with the gun we have, we are not super effective against uh, the heavy armored uh, melee guys. So maybe the best shot we can take. Can I do something else? I want to overwatch on the heavy. But what else? Do I just reload? No, we don't really need ammo. I don't know what to do. There's nothing to do. God damn it. Maybe we can hit this guy a little bit. Let's just take a shot. Help me, Daoud. I like that they have names. Alright, let's defend. But only if they get close. Okay, that's the plan. Oh, running away bleeding? I like that. <gasps> Disabled my head. I should have read. He's a bush man. Oh, what? That was one hell of a throw, by the way. Whoa, what? <laughs> Equipment damaged. What is this? Adela Mendoza. A berserker. doesn't say anything about throwing uh, fireballs. I don't know. Do they have like uh, grenades in secret? 
Okay, well, I guess we have to pay attention to that. And that was a pretty big uh, hit that we just we suffered. Actually, Ready. if we take two of that, we just die. The heavy guy is in the back. Can be. It's possible that I can take a shot. Well, we can take a shot on the guy in the back, but I'm more concerned about the guy who's close to us. That position allows Moving us to take a shot at both. Let's uh, explore it. I would rather take this shot. But maybe from over here it's even better. Even though it puts us in the open. Something like that. He's going to die to bleed. Disabled head. He's not dying to bleed, but almost. No choice but to keep going. Uh, I can just come to the side. Make a shot. Okay, come to the side even more. Make a shot. Pretty sure that was a kill. Then hide properly. Uh, maybe make a yeah. Need a better position. Pop the med kit. Uh, we definitely want to pop the med kit here as well. What's our move? Do we have heals? He does have a Can heal. Have a Do we have a heal here? Okay, let's put it in. That costs us one action point. Use it. Uh, use the med kit. That's fine. And just hide. For now. Right there. We shouldn't get hit again. The big boy. Uh, I don't know what to do. So we know about the heavy. If he heavy tries to rush in, he's gonna be fucked. But there's not much we can do here. I just, let's just wait. He's running away, most likely trying to save himself. It's gonna be like another stupid grenade. Yeah. Just taking damage, let's do a heal. So far, my favorite is the sniper. Can we get an angle? We cannot get an angle on this guy. He's hiding. We can't even, cannot even get an angle on the... Okay, fine. On the heavy. If we get close to the heavy and we just get hit, that's stupid. So... Let's not do that. Oh, actually, we don't have a rifle. So we can't check. How can we see him? That's a terrible uh, cover, so we're gonna cover like this. Hopefully pin him down. Uh, I don't know what to do with this. Uh, I I'm mostly concerned about his bullshit grenade. Which he's throwing so damn accurately. I don't really get that. <laughs> That's too good, mate. What the fuck? I'm not too concerned about the heavy right now. Seems like he... Wait, what? Oh no. I don't have uh, the action points. Let's go back. Or should be. I should be concerned about the heavy a little bit. Well, I can't uh, overwatch with the grenade. Let's just wait there. And just overwatch normally here. Holding position. And maybe you're just gonna stay there and we wait. <coughs> Running away, but he should bleed to death. Heavy is playing it super safe. Okay. So we can make a shot on his head. On the heavy's head. But that's not what I want. I want to make a shot on this berserker's head. So let's make it a thing. He's super tanky. 
it regenerates and fire resistant. If we take out his leg, that's gonna be 30 HP. Uh, same thing for his head. Marduk's fist. Ah, uh, let's just shoot him in the head. We can also make a, a pistol shot at him. Can we? Oh, we don't have enough action points. Yeah, we don't. Because I also moved. Moved out of cover to make this shot. Ooh, I would move into the range of the heavy. I mean... Oh, man. If, if he could make that shot, that would be nice. I don't want to move into the range of the heavy. Moving. That's for sure. Okay, let's move by two. The problem is his tankiness. How much damage this deals? In order to deal damage to him, it's gotta be a heavy weapon. Everything else is useless. I mean, this is like a... 30% chance to hit him. A lot better than zero. Okay, let's, let's just get in closer. And maybe try to pin down the heavy. And we cannot use the rifle because our hand is destroyed. But I don't want to use the grenade because that takes forever to craft. <laughs> So we're just playing it safe here. Also, he's pretty tanky. The soul right pull is not good. He's recovering Will. Okay. We can get in range of him. Let's see what we can do. Sniper rifle. Ready to fire. Uh, that's not a great shot. Let's try Target. to find an angle. That's a pretty great shot. Yeah. He's just ticking around now. What's our move? Uh, we can just pop out of cover, out. hit him, and uh, pop back in. Uh, that's not good. Yeah. Aiming. I mean, there's a chance to hit him. Missed. He can't go back. <sighs> the grenade wouldn't kill him. Wait, do we know how much damage the grenade deals? It deals 50 damage and blasts 3 armor. So... But it's also affected by armor, so... It's unclear what armor part would really stop this, but his HP is obviously too high for grenades. I just tried to get in range of him. And make a shot. Uh, a little bit to the left. Targeting. Okay. It's not great. Let's hide. Out of ammo reload? Uh, sure. Can't do it now. It's too tanky. Unless he just bleeds because of the grenade. No, he's not gonna take enough damage. He's a bastard. Unless he, his, one of his parts get destroyed because of the grenade. But that's not gonna work. The only part that would be relevant is his head. But that's not gonna be destroyed. God damn it. What a bastard. Alright, let's just end turn. Next turn he's dead. They can't scare me. He's overwatching now. Well, you can do the same. I'm 
I'm on Overwatch. Receiving loud and clear. Wait, okay, we need to reload. Got this covered. Here. Um. Okay. <laughs> what the hell, mates? Holding position. Stop watching. Start moving, mate. We've got this covered. <laughs> Sniper, please. Yeah. Lots more where that came from. Okay, he should be dead now. Let's Love go. to save. He left the space spot, so let's make a shot. Heavy, you got this. Just a bit off. What a piece of shit weapon. Can you make a shot? Ooh, let's get close and make a shot. Moving now. Acquiring target. Yeah, this is fine. Okay. We need to obtain the research data still, which is over there. So let's start getting closer. And uh, yeah, everyone gets closer. One faction actually wants superhumans. I wonder if that uh, includes. Uh, regenerating limbs. Channel open. <laughs> Via mission. <laughs> I could get on board with that. Or maybe become, uh, I'm ready. robots. On the double. Yeah, fuck that. Fuck humans. Let's make robots. Robot, I mean, uh, humans suck. Hell, robots. All, all day, every day. Sure. We have to wait for the animation. Like, I don't really have an option to On the just uh, queue up multiple animations at the same time. Which I would like to do. I'm ready. Alright, we got him now. Uh, just, just pick it up. Look at that! No one joined me. So we didn't pick up their gear, but I suspect we're just gonna find it. Anyway, ooh, everyone level four. I don't mind that. Back to Geoscape. Well, yeah, we know about that. Supportive factions. Well, no one is supportive just yet. Cool air, exploration site. 200 tech, food and materials. That's nice, I guess. But the most important part... In the 1960s, is the, mission. the Phoenix Project clashed with an unknown intelligent outfit associated with the CIA. One of these clashes concerned the cultures stored in this lab, said to be responsible for a terrible plague, somewhere in what was then called the Third World. At the time of his death, my great-grandfather was trying to force the CIA to at least share some samples, but they denied everything, even the existence of this lab. It looks like the research was abandoned in the late 1970s. I'm not sure why. The samples are degraded, but if my analysis is correct, this is the Pandora virus. Sometimes I wonder whether the only reason we survived as a species is sheer luck. She luck. Okay. <laughs> well, humans are pretty keen on killing each other, so... We can maybe do a scan here. Can we establish new bases? The most important part is just to go back home. Actually, we can, uh... Set up the personnel. Training. We can make Nikita Pitaxa a sniper. Which is quite interesting, but it doesn't fit with anything <laughs> he has access so far. What is this new class? Okay, so we can become an assault or a sniper, 
This gives us access to sniper rifles and pistols. And this gives us access to... Wait. I, I can just check. Do we have access to anything else? Uh, the heavy also gives us access to uh, jetpack, yeah. Heavy weapons, mounted weapons and jetpack. So in that way, maybe the heavy is the best. Sniper training gives us access to sniper rifles and handguns. And uh, assault rifles and shotguns. Shotguns would be pretty interesting. I don't know if you want to train in a secondary class. I don't know if you want heavy weapons at all. What about shotguns? Aren't they a good, good weapons? Can I make shotguns? So... No. We don't have access to any shotguns. At all. We're making the body armor for the newbie. And making the Hell 2 cannon. For... <sighs> do we want to do the Hell 2 cannon? I think it's a more... Yeah, I think we should do it, because... Because we also get 30% bonus damage and 10 perception. Like, that's gotta be like, insta-kill every time, right? Fred can do it. I mean, that seems be better than the, the uh, extra training, because we just get... But we get 30... Yeah, 30% 30 bonus damage and minus 10 perception. Yeah, mounted weapons. I think the strongman seems pretty good. And, uh... Wait, does uh, heavy weapon slow down our movement speed? I don't think so. It also shreds armor. So, Fred... It's kind of pointless to, get a, to pick up the strongman now. Because we can't use it. And, uh... We have two speed. We have we have twenty speed, and the question is, what do we want? I have access to two dashes. I guess we can go uh, strength. Uh, that would go over a little bit, but that's fine. So we just get extra strength. So he's pretty strong. Runs in with a heavy weapon eventually, or maybe we can have a heavy weapon and an assault rifle. Uh, that could be very nice. And, uh, yeah. Uh, that's the plan for Fred. Cameron, Dragonbeard, is a little bit of a, a spotter here. That's useless. And I don't know if we want a new class at all. Like, do we want sniper rifles? Not really. Heavy, I mean, not without the bonus. So I think this is just fine. We have access to... Uh, 9 wheel power allows us to run twice. We have uh, 20 speed, allows us to run uh, 4 times, 5 squares. We can get more strength, which is nice. So, what are the obvious upgrades here? Either we become even faster, so we can go like 4 more speed, or we can go 4 more wheel power, so we have 1 extra dash. Although, that doesn't give us. That, that just gives us something extra in a longer fight. So if the if we only would use dash twice, then willpower 11 actually gives us no advantage at all. Uh, something to consider. Speed. Again, if, if we don't have to run that far, then speed is useless. Strength is just more HP, and this is like, how much HP we got? I think it's a little unclear. I think it's like 160 or something. I think it's 150. Can we check their HP? Uh, dragon. Yeah, it's 10 times your strength. So we can up her, her HP significantly, which I think not dying does sound pretty good. So Cameron Dragon Beards, we can just go with not dying. But I'm not sure if that is wait. Ma uh, strength determines maximum hit points, the weight ca that can be carried, and how far items can be thrown. 
Uh, but she's not really a item thrower here. And it doesn't affect melee damage. So just carry weight, hit points, and uh, grenade throwing. So strength is not super important. I don't know. I'm a little bit tempted to go with willpower here. So we have even more dashes. Because that's kind of how we play here. We go with like 11 willpower. No, no, actually that's too much, isn't it? So this gives us, us 9. This gives us 13. And that's just 11. We need 13, so we need 11. And uh, we're just gonna up strength. So it's a little bit of a uh, mix. So I think this is gonna be fine. Uh, this guy is not seeing any action. The heavy guy. We can go for a sniper here. I mean, does this really make sense? So with this we can actually just fly to specific locations. It doesn't make sense right now because we don't have a sniper gun. But I might just save 25 points for that. A real power. Do we need the speed? Also, his armor is not suited for it because it this actually reduces accuracy. I think all the pieces reduce accuracy. Yeah, all of them. So that's minus 30 accuracy. So he would need to build uh, very differently for that to make sense. I don't know. Very tough. We just need more gear. But I think this is an interesting option. That's useless. 50% bonus healing with and two willpower. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's possible that I'm just gonna make him a sniper because that seems pretty okay to me. Or at very least, I mean this seems like a better option instead of the new class so we can have a heavy training and a sniper rifle. I might just keep the, the armor because that allows us to fly. Uh, this has the jetpack on it, I believe. I'm not sure if they actually... Okay, he doesn't have the jetpack here. Armor. What would be interesting to see... I'll, I'll just do this when we get a new armor. I'm, I don't want to strip anyone right now, but... Just see if, if we get a jetpack. If we uh, use someone else's armor. Uh, not a heavy armor. So yeah, this looks like a good combo. <laughs> uh, but let's just get a little bit. So, 9 willpower. Actually, that's gonna drop by 4. Uh, that, that's, I think the 9 willpower is fine. We are a little bit slowed down. I, I just, I just kind of want to go strength here. I think that still makes sense. We might just be a heavy first and have a sniper as a backup. In that case, like, I don't know, I don't know. But I'm definitely going sniperist if we want a sniper rifle. Uh, and we got Eric who has a lot of points and we know right now that quick aim is uh, free of willpower and our willpower is actually only four. And I don't really want a new class, I feel like. The pistols and the sniper rifles are totally good enough. I don't know if I want extra speed. His, his strength is also kind of fine. Uh, we can up his speed by 3. And that would give him... He's currently at 13. So we can up his speed by 3. And with the minus one, that's still a 16. So he's a little faster now. We can up his willpower to 12. And that gives him access to... Uh, no, actually, we can only up it by 3. So with the minus four, we are still gonna be at 7. So we can use quick aim twice. That's just an option. And other than that, we're just going strength. So, we don't die. And we're not using this currently. We might want to go to 
And pick up strong man. I mean, you just want to use the points because if you don't spend it and you die, you just gotta feel a little silly. So, I mean, let's just go for that. And having a balanced character is probably pretty sensible. I can just go and get some ammo. Ammo is instant, so uh, ultimately uh, going for ammo is the best option. Okay. Pandoran colony. Wait, I can, can I add this to the research line? No, we already have uh, way too many items uh, lined up. I want a PX Scarab as well. Uh, but the guys just need to chill out here. Anyway, guys, uh, that's it for now. Uh, I, I guess this game is just gonna have longer episodes because the turn-based combat is just pretty long, you know? I, I can, like, fit in, like, one fight into a video. And, yeah, basically. Anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Next time.